Maryland football hosted its annual Pro Day Wednesday where members of the team performed in front of NFL scouts. Players participated in an array of drills like the 40-yard dash, the broad jump, and specific position drills. 63 representatives from 31 of the 32 NFL teams were here at Jones Hill House evaluating the prospective talent. Yeah, I mean it is. Obviously when you look and, and you see that 31 of the 32 NFL teams are here represented and it would have been all 32 had uh, Kansas City got not got snowed in. Uh, I think it speaks to the what the Maryland football brand has become. Um, we sent seven guys to the combine. Uh, we obviously have probably another five to seven guys that probably perform really well. I haven't seen any of the numbers yet, been upstairs, but I think it's a testament to the trajectory of what Maryland football can be in terms of the development of our players. Projected first round pick Deontay Banks did not participate in today's pro day. The eyes were on the receiving room with Rakim Jarrett, Dante Demas, and Jacob Copeland all participating. I felt like I, I checked any boxes I had to answer left for the scouts and for the teams. Uh, I came out, was smooth, uh, was fast, got out, in and out my breaks, caught the ball well, so I think it went well. Kicker Chad Ryland, defensive back Jacorian Bennett, and lineman Greg China Rose were just a few of the other members of the Duke's Mayo Bowl championship crew looking to increase their draft stock. With the conclusion of the NFL Combine and Maryland Pro Day, these Terps will have to wait until April 27th to hopefully hear their names called on draft night. For Terrapin Sports Central, I'm Ricky Podgorski.